There's something wrong with the car. Help! Oh, oh I'll help you, Gazella. <laughs> right after you answer a few simple questions. <laughs> you can really use. That's what I call investigative journalism. Isn't it time you traded in all that bogus gossip for the real kind? Say hello to reality or whiskey. The hot new game where you have to reveal your deepest secrets or face a challenge. Reality or risk? Sorry to burst your bubble head, Mandy, but truth or dare has been around for ages. Excuse me, were you not listening? This game is not truth or dare. It comes from Ferrari and it has a fancy carrying case. Now, who wants to go first? Oh, forget it, Mandy. We're not interested in your stupid game. Of course you are. And the first player is... <laughs> Reality or risque? Reality. How many boys did you kiss this week? Um, five. No, 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 wait, six. <laughs> <laughs> what? Sam is next. Reality. Ew! What is the name of the first boy you ever kissed? <laughs> Lloyd Bradley, sixth grade. Our braces got stuck together. <laughs> Charming. Okay, one more spin. Alex! Reality or risky? Reality. Ooh! <laughs> what is the name of your very best friend? Clover and Sam, duh. <laughs> You have to choose one. No, I don't. I like them both the same. If you refuse to answer the reality, then you have to take the risk. Fine, I'll take the risk then. Good! Then risk losing a friend by telling the name of your very best one. Get it! I'm not gonna choose between Sam and Clover just because of your stupid game. Ugh. Wow, she's really angry. Must have something to hide. <gasps> Alex, wait! Hey, is anybody gonna finish this ice cream? Alex, calm down. We would never let anything Mandy says come between us. Yeah, Alex, you know we'll always stick together no matter what. Ah! Sorry for the interruption, ladies. However, knowing your overdeveloped tendencies towards celebrity worship, I don't think you'll mind. Hey, that's Jackson John's private glass jet. Jackson John? As in the slightly kooky, totally reclusive pop singer? He's not kooky. He's the best. His music really speaks to me. You and a bunch of old people. I mean, hello, over the hell much. Spokes, please. The artistic merits of Mr. John's music are none of Whoop's concern. His attempted abduction, however, is. <gasps> it appears that Mr. John was attacked by a man impersonating his pilot. Luckily, he showed some moxie and was able to escape. Who would try such a weird kidnapping? I don't know. And neither does Jackson John, which is why he's hired you to find out. You mean, we're going to JJ Lynn Ranch? Uh, yes. Awesome! Um, I thought you said he was for old people. I thought you said he was kooky. Now, your gadgets. Gladys? Today you'll be receiving titanium drill heels, Neptron extendable bot mascara, and the always fashionable earring communicators, now with faux sapphire bobble. Just uh, one more thing, Miss Spies. If it's not too much trouble, uh, would you mind asking Jackson John for his autograph for me? My, my, <clears throat> my niece. Sure thing, Jer. <laughs> Very good then. Off you go. of opinion on stuff like that. Um, sure, Sam. Hey, Alex. <laughs> you know I wasn't the 
suggesting you were out of touch when I said Jackson John was for old people, right? I mean, just because we're best friends doesn't mean we have to agree all the time. Okay, Clover. Hey, what are you guys talking about? Nothing. Just a private conversation between two best friends. Really? Then don't you think the best friends should be included? Hey, look, an elephant. Nice try, Alex. No, really. Look. An elephant and an emu and some monkeys. It's the JJ Land Zoo. It's a regular Tuesday afternoon event, actually. You three must be the agents from Whoop. I'm Jackson John. Mr. John, I can't believe we're really meeting you. Call me JJ. <laughs> like we couldn't tell. Though it's usually the bad guys who have the crazy costumes. <laughs> that was quick thinking the other day, JJ. You had a narrow escape. Yeah, it was close. I nearly had my privacy invaded. I'm sure whoever it was will die again. Don't worry, JJ. We'll take it from here. We'll start by searching every inch of the ranch to make sure it's safe. Shouldn't one of us stay with JJ? What if someone tries to take him while none of us is around? Here, take this earring. It's really a communicator, and you can call us if you're in trouble. Brilliant. I'll be in my aromatherapy chamber. Make yourself at home. Okay, spies. If this bad guy is still on the ranch, we may as well try to lure him out disguised as Jackson John. <laughs> Think these disguises will get the bad guy's attention? I think they get anybody's attention. Come on. Everything at the amusement park is, um, normal, I guess. What about you, Clover? <laughs> Other than the fact that there's a monkey on my shoulder, everything's pitchy. Alex? All quiet at the JJ Land train station. Maybe I'll take a ride, you know, to look for signs of trouble around the estate. JJ on them? Sam, that is the Yes Way logo. Let's see what Whoop knows about this rag. Hello, spies. How goes the mission? Mr. John's still safe? He's fine, Jer, but Alex has just been kidnapped. We think the bad guy is connected to Yes Way magazine. Yes Way. Hmm. Let's see. Ah, yes, here we are. Cyril Hearsay, a former celebrity bodyguard, used his connections to open his own magazine with headquarters right in Beverly Hills. Then I guess we know where we need to go. I'll send you the Whoop Chopper. Somebody stop the presses. 
like printing equipment. It looks like a chemistry set. I think I found the formula for whatever's in those speakers, Clover. It's some kind of truth serum. Hey, so that's how Yes Way's been getting all the good celeb dirt. Cyril just kidnaps them and uses his truth serum to make them spill their guts. If only he had some kind of record of where he might be holding Alex. gave me a blast of his truth serum, so I have to tell the truth. Oh, you do, do you? Then maybe you could tell us the name of your oldest and dearest friend. Sure, that would be Ollie. <laughs> Ollie! Ollie! Another shocking <gasps> true story uncovered at Yes Way magazine. Cyril Hearsay! In the flesh. Your gossip-mongering days are over, Hearsay. You will never use your truth serum on anyone again. Yeah! From now on, celebrity gossip will be about rumors and innuendo, just like it should be. And just how are you ladies going to stop me? Well, they'll probably catch you in their mascara net launchers, break me out of here with their drill heel boots, and then call for Whoop back up with their X powders. <gasps> Alex! <laughs> Sorry, guys. Let me tell you about the magazine business, ladies. It all starts with newsprint. <laughs> for delivery. You better quit before you do something you regret, Cyril. Regret? I don't think so. In fact, now that I've met Alex, I can eliminate the competition by more direct means. What are you talking about? I'll just use her and all her secrets to infiltrate Whoop, then launch their weapons against the other tabloids. As if. Alex will never tell you any Whoop secrets. Yes, I will. I'm under the influence of the truth serum, remember? You see? Alex is my new best friend. But Zero, you're not my best friend. You're more of an enemy, really. <laughs> yes. You're still under the influence of my serum. You have to tell the truth. She is telling the truth. <gasps> Whoop agents don't know everything about Whoop operations. But I do. Gary, am I glad to see you? Really? This is so embarrassing. Whoop agents getting our gadgets taken away and having to call a pop singer for a ride. On the other hand, we are riding in Jackson John's private glass jet. Oh, man. This old beater, I'm training it in for the luxury version next week. Hmm. Hey, Jerry, nice move. How do I defeat him? Dunno. I didn't even know he could fight like that. Wow. There's quite a lot you spies don't know about me. <laughs> now, 
Jerry, is it? Perhaps you'd be so kind as to tell me about the latest in Whoop weaponry. Certainly. Press the blue button on the console. <laughs> this is the paparazzo. Press the green button on the side, please. It sounds like it's charging. It is. Pressing the green button a second time will trigger a flash of light that will stun any opponent. You expect me to wipe out the competition with this toy? Well, of course not. That's the tabletop version. Press the red button, please. This is the full-sized version of the paparazzo with a 50 megawatt adjustable firista flash. At full power, it can permanently blind anyone in a five block radius. It is. It's perfect. My rivals can't put out a paper if they can't see. Simply type in the coordinates of the target and hit enter. A countdown will let you know when the charge is ready. <laughs> Stop the presses, Cyril. We've got a late-breaking story for you. Yeah, the bad guy gets butt kicked. Really? That sounds like a rumor. Unless you can back it up with some facts. <laughs> Sam, use that gadget on the console. Tell Clover to close her eyes, then press the green button. Okay. Take pictures or something? No, it stuns people, and the giant version is about to blind a whole building full of people unless you stop it. You can't stop it. Once the paparazzo is charged, it has to be released. Huh? I suggest you divert the weapon from its target to somewhere where it can't do any harm. I can't divert it! The target is locked in! And we'll never reach the paparazzo in time! Yes, we will! And we'll divert the flash. Hello? Jackson? <laughs> JJ, this is going to take some perfect timing. See, give me a countdown. Right. best job you've ever done. What's that supposed to mean? He must be under the influence of the truth serum. Hey, maybe we should play reality or risk with Jerry while we got the chance. He did say that there was a lot we didn't know about him. <laughs> <laughs> what do you say, dear, now that you have to tell the truth? Even you can't counteract the truth serum, can you? No, Clover, I have to tell the truth until the serum wears off. Uh, but a good spy knows how to avoid an interrogation. <laughs> Okay, but he wasn't just some guy, he was Clover's 
boyfriend. I know it was wrong, but I totally dug him. And it's not like I stole him from her. But I tried. I even dressed like her so he'd like me. When will this truth serum wear off already? <laughs>